No. Please. Please. <laughs> right now, I'm soaking my foot in some Epsom salts in the water. So all the other day, I just got my ingrown toenail removed, so I have to do all these things. And it was a little infected, so I had to get Epsom salts, get antibiotics, get antibiotic ointment cream. So basically, the antibiotic will work from the inside, chemically, and the ointment cream working on it physically from the outside. So we got like two ways coming in to destroy the infection. Um, and then I'm still getting water to kind of like open up the wound, like clean it out and stuff like that. And I have to keep it dry while I'm taking a shower. I don't even take showers now, I have to take a bath and it's like the weirdest thing ever to do that. It's like, it's like I'm 12. Well, today I've just been chilling. I mean, I went to, with my dad to the grocery store. We went to a few places and got food, the grocery stores, and then came back home, went to the gym, and now I'm here. And I think I'm about to watch Maybe I'll play Smash or I'll watch the Teen, I'll watch the teen Times movie. But yeah, um, today today at the gym I did um, I did back day and no no sorry I did chest day. Um, so the thing about chest is crazy thing happened today. A guy today he has 345 plates and he has a 25 plate along with that. So that's how much 45 45 that's. Three, that's 135 plus a 25, that's 150 on each side. That's 300 pounds he was lifting to do a bench press on each side. And he, had, he had someone hold, watching him, you know. He had someone who was there to help him out with this. assist. And as soon as he put, does a, pushes up to do the bench press, like he pushes up to do, it just like snaps and just falls on him. And he got like three different like swole as hell dudes just like run in there and do that. That made me happy today. It freaked me out, but the adrenaline was pumping my system because I was about to go get to, to go over there. But it was like, made me happy to see like human lives, like people care about each other and realize, hey, we're not the only ones here. We're all human. We all need to care about each other because this shit's like, that's what happens still. You know, like you just collapse under the weight of your things. Just do. And always make sure if you're not bench pressing with like someone to, to watch you like to assist you, make sure you're not doing super heavy weights, because you can't, because that stuff could happen, and no one's there, you basically send yourself to a grave, because working out is a dangerous thing, like, it's not as easy as people think it is, it's not, like, difficult, working out is very scary, you know, it can be dangerous if you don't do the right form, it's dangerous if you, you don't, if you can't handle the weight, it's always making sure you're doing the right form, make sure you can handle the weight, don't do it to a weight where it's, like, impossible to even move it, and then you just drop it and cause injury to yourself. Because part of working out is just enjoy yourself, having fun. Um, I don't know. Hopefully one day I'll get someone who, if I start getting, if I work out, have a workout partner or something, I'll get someone to like record me doing workouts and show you guys examples how to properly do workouts. I mean, properly, because I don't even know if I'm doing 100%. Like, I'm, every day I'm trying to get my form like perfect, like per perfect on all my workouts, you know, because that's the, that's the first thing you worry about your workouts is make sure you have the right form before you can do anything intense. Because if you have the crappiest form in the world, you can't do anything, you know? And that's what you do, you know? Uh, let's see, what else are we gonna talk about? That's pretty much it right now, I mean, I don't know. Maybe I'll show you more. Oh! I need everyone to ask me, do you guys want more of that footage, you know, from the concerts? You guys want me to put all the concerts I've been to this year thus far, or what's up? Because I'm, I'm, in two weeks, I'm seeing Kendrick Lamar and Travis Scott in Dallas, and I'm going to definitely get as much as I can out of that vlog. Make sure to definitely get as much from, like, me going from the dart station to the venue, showing you the merch, showing you, like, drum, showing you some Travis Scott, showing you some Kendrick. Like, I want to make sure I get everything as much as I can, you know, like, because I'm going to be, because I'm going to be vlogging, so I promise, but I'm not trying to vlog the whole thing, because I'm trying to enjoy myself during the concert and turn up. That's all it is. Because I'm, I'm raging. I told you I'm going to rage. Like Travis Scott always said, let's rage, you know, we're going to fucking rage. And the lines to be insane, because not even, I don't even know how it's going to work, because it, we're doing, it's floor seating, right, for Dallas, if anyone's going they're doing floor seating, which I don't get. Especially when you got Travis Scott, the guy who's, man, who's been known to start riots, just how good he is. Like his, he starts riots with how crazy his concerts get. I don't know how it's gonna work with having chairs on the way where everyone wants to rage and like, just let loose and 
It's gonna be a crazy night. Um, so I cannot like literally wait two exact weeks from that, like tomorrow. I've been waiting since May, since I got the tickets in May. I think May, since the tickets dropped, I've been waiting for this thing to happen. I'm excited to see Kendra for the first time. I've seen Travis Scott live for, for like not even too long ago in the weirdest place, Waco, Texas. I know. It's like, but. Well, who knows? We'll see how it goes. Anyways. <laughs>